It's perfectly normal to choose a coffee by its tight face, right? the next video doesn't have any clips of me sort of at one o'clock looking haggard and sounding croaky I think that's going to be a good positive step. <laughs> it's just gone half one in the morning not quite gone to earlier plans but sometimes you just have to stay up and get things done so it's also I think it's also still a good habit of actually getting things finished and completed you know, rather than continually put them off which is one of the reasons why these late nights happen so it's kind of a one step backwards two step forwards hopefully but well we'll see how it goes and I'll crack on <laughs> doing work for the Upper Lock Cafe in Stroud for a few weeks now and it's been quite a big project that I had from working on smaller boards inside, big menu board inside and a few A boards for the outside as well. This this is the last one to work on and this is for just at their main entrance so it's kind of a general welcome sign and the reverse will be to let them know that if well, they're not serving food they're still open. It's sad to see the end of this project. I've really, really enjoyed working on it. It's been one of the biggest. It's based, they're my first sort of big client since my reg, the regular work that I do. So that's been really exciting, and it's helped diversify my portfolio and hopefully get my work seen by more people, and you know, start building a little bit of a reputation in the area. So I'm going to get this finished, and then after that, it's kind of all focus on the Design Cuts product, which is another big new thing that I'm going to be doing. So uh, yeah, I, I don't know, it's kind of, it's just so cool to be doing such a, a diverse range of things and, you know, seeing what the possibilities are of what I'm doing and, you know, just getting ideas and a bit more driven to see actually how I can push things and where I can take them. It's been really cool, but I could happily ramble on for ages. So I'm going to get this done and crack on because there is there is loads to do and I'm still partly determined to actually fulfill my promise of getting sleep. So let's do that.
side of it. I've got to turn it around and do the other side with a sort of different design and notification. And then that's this product all wrapped up. It's all good. Alright, I'm going to need some sustenance. I can spot a thirsty ref from a mile off. Mmm, typography coffee. It's perfectly normal to choose a coffee by its typeface, right? is now completed which means this project has been is finished so I'm gonna go take that back to them tomorrow one thing I thought I would mention about this board it's quite interesting that it includes the words closed and open which can send out quite confusing mixed messages whereas in this situation what they're saying is we don't serve hot food anymore but they are still open for teas, coffees and cake. So the important thing to consider in this situation was that the word open was what stood out most, which is why we've got the big text. It's big, bold, it fills up a lot of the board. And it also matches another A board that they have outside, which says we're open. And the closed, the text that's been used for the word closed is quite sort of dainty and narrow and not overpowering. So it gets the message across, but the main the main call to action for this sign is to let people know that the cafe is still open. It's been a fun, it's been really fun to work on and I'm really, really happy with the outcome. Let's see if I can turn this round without breaking myself or the board. <laughs> and yeah, so there, that's both sides and loads of, loads of opportunities for lots of different typefaces, lettering, flourishes, and I've really learned a lot from doing this project. So. Kind of sad to see it end, but now excited to to move on to other things and get stuck into the design cuts project, which is the next the next mega one. I'm gonna have to get a van at this rate. <laughs> just finished doing the board now for the project for the Uplook Cafe and delivered the final board. They're really happy with it. It's um, it's kind of sad to finish because it's such a lovely place to work and the staff are really friendly and made good friends with them and they insisted that I take a, a coffee before I leave. They've kind of feeding my addiction, seeing it in action so much. It was really, it was fantastic to work on. It was great to have like a new big project and on to, on to the new, next big thing. Mm -hmm.